It's no secret that the automotive industry is undergoing a major transformation. As the world shifts towards a more sustainable future, automakers are investing heavily in electric vehicle technology. And let me tell you, the future looks electrifying. In the coming years, we're set to witness a wave of mind-blowing electric cars from some of the biggest names in the industry. Buckle up folks, because this is just the beginning. Let's take a sneak peek at what's in store. Number 10, Ford Bronco Electric 2029. While Ford has confirmed that an all-electric Bronco is on the horizon, the company is hush-hush about when it will be unveiled. A Bronco and Bronco Sport Hybrid version are rumored to be produced in 2024, and Ford has the resources to make the Bronco EV. A product map leak on a Bronco forum called Bronco 6G showed the supposed EV launching on a new Tay1 platform with a production date of November 2029. So, it begs the question, why wait? Especially when Jeep, Ford's biggest off-road competitor, will have an all-electric Wrangler by 2025. Number 9, Faraday Future FF91 2023. Faraday Future, founded and based in California, is set to finally produce and sell its flagship EV, the FF91, after a few delays due to supply chain issues. The FF91 has been struggling to debut since 2017, so another delay wouldn't be shocking but we remain hopeful all systems are a go this time. With the top range model set to cost over $200,000, this car isn't priced for all buyers. It travels for 381 miles on a single charge. The FF91 uses three motors, one up front and two in the back that make a combined 1,050 horsepower. It sprints from zero to 60 miles per hour in 2.4 seconds. Number eight, Dodge Charger EV 2024. After causing heartbreak among the masses with the announcement that the V8 power plants in the Charger and Challenger would be axed in favor of batteries, Dodge finally revealed what people have to look forward to in regards to the all-electric Charger. First unveiled as the Dodge Charger Daytona SRT concept, the EV in question created a buzz when it was announced that it would generate up to 590 horsepower and sound like it with speakers to capture the hearts of combustion diehards. There will also be a top-tier trim level that boasts an 800-volt Banshee propulsion system, though power figures are a mystery for now. While Dodge is happy to talk about horsepower, the company has been silent about what the range would be like for the Charger EV. Number 7, Chrysler Airflow 2025. Eager to have a piece of the electrified pie, Chrysler unveils the Airflow. Offering graceful design cues, the Airflow aims to be luxurious and comfortable. The base model is anticipated to cost around $55,000, while the top trim is expected to be priced at around $65,000. The Airflow comes with a motor on the front axle and one on the rear, giving it the safety benefits of all-wheel drive while providing more stability in cornering and general handling. In addition, it's estimated it will travel up to 400 miles with a full charge. Number 6, Chevrolet Equinox EV 2024. The Equinox EV is for drivers seeking a small, green SUV that's also affordable. With the 1LT base model starting at roughly $30,000, it's one of the least expensive all-electric vehicles on the market. This Chevy treks up to 300 miles on a single charge and adds 70 miles of range in 10 minutes with DC fast charging. At home, under normal charging circumstances, the Equinox adds up to 34 miles of range per hour of charging. The Equinox will come with five trim options. The top three rupees trim includes a heated steering wheel, heated and ventilated front seats and adaptive cruise control. Number 5. Buick Electra E5 2024. The Buick Electra E5, affectionately named after the luxury sedan produced between 1959 and 1990, will be the company's first all-electric SUV. Built on GM's versatile Ultium platform, this model will likely share similarities with the Cadillac Larique. Hopefully, that means 340 horsepower, at least, and more than 300 miles of driving range with a single charge. Buick plans to produce the Electra E5 in China for an overseas market. However, we're not sure if it will make the American version here or import it from China. Exact pricing is still a mystery but will likely start at around $50,000.
Number 4. Cadillac Celestique 2024. Another model built on GM's Ultium platform is the Cadillac Celestique. This ultra-luxury sport sedan mates a 111 kWh battery system with a dual-motor all-wheel drive setup to produce 600 horsepower and 640 pound-feet of torque. Aiming to unite performance and range, the Celestique has an estimated range of around 300 miles on a full charge and a 0 to 60 time of 3.8 seconds. When using a 200 kWdc fast charger, you can add 78 miles of range in just 10 minutes. Production will begin in December of 2023, and pricing will start at over $300,000. Number 3. Chevrolet Blazer EV 2024 With the Blazer EV, Chevy turns its famed off-roader into an all-electric family hauler. It comes with a range of trims, topped by the high-performance SS. GM claims that the Blazer will be capable of a 320-mile range on a full charge and will have a 0 to 60 miles per hour time of under 4 seconds on the SS trim level. Like many other EVs on this list, it will also be built on the Ultium platform coming with quick charging times and impressive ranges. The base model trim, the 1LT, will start at $45,000, while the top trim, the SS, begins at $66,000. Number 2. Audi A6 e-tron 2023 Audi got on board early with the current trend of releasing luxurious, planet-friendly EVs. One such vehicle is the A6 e-tron, a sedan set to get around 400 miles of range on a single charge. Audi claims the A6 can go from 5 to 80% charge in just 25 minutes. The front and rear axles each have a separate electric motor, making this an all-wheel drive vehicle. And since this is an Audi, you can expect the cabin to be luxurious and comfortable. Audi hasn't announced how much this EV will cost. But it's expected to be priced similarly to the Tesla Model S 2023 Audi Q4 e-tron is a well-balanced and upmarket electric SUV with an attractive price tag, but its middle-of-the-road performance and so-so driving range make it less appealing. 2023 Q4 e-tron is a good electric SUV, but it's not without a few faults. Available in SUV and coupe-like sportback body styles, the Q4 e-tron has a spacious interior and relatively low starting price for the segment, and even the base model is packed with standard tech and driver assistance features. It offers a decent all-electric driving range of up to 265 miles on a full charge. That said, its powertrains aren't as muscular as those found in many rival vehicles. The Q4 e-tron also has a stiff ride and slightly cheap-feeling interior for an Audi. Number 1, Apple Car 2026 The Apple Car has been shrouded in mystery since the first dribble of information was released. This project has evolved over the years due to changes in the leadership at Apple and other issues. In the earliest stages, it was reported that the Apple Car would be self-driving. Then rumors suggested Apple had shelved the project. Over the past couple of years, the project has regained momentum, but Apple has scaled it back. Instead of being fully autonomous, the Apple car is now slated as a semi-autonomous vehicle. It can drive autonomously on highways but requires manual driving in the city and during emergencies. Apple is new to carmaking. Because of this, the company is said to be seeking partnerships within the automobile industry to build the Apple car. Apple is said to be planning a launch date of 2026, with pricing set at around $100,000. We hope you're as excited as we are about the incredible electric cars that await us in the coming years. Make sure to stay subscribed to our channel and hit that notification bell, so you don't miss a single update. Thank you all for joining us on this electrifying adventure. Remember, the future is electric, and together, we're driving towards a cleaner, greener, and more sustainable world. Stay charged, stay connected, and we'll see you in the next video. This is What's Up USA, signing off.